I am going to enlighten you today because today I am going to share the five reasons why you have nothing to wear. I think we can all relate to the fact that we have a closet full of clothes and nothing to wear, but I have the answers and I am going to pinpoint them today. And you guys, this is going to be life-changing. Number one reason, you do not have enough simple basics. I am talking t-shirt, tanks, button-down shirts, basically the things that you wear the most and grab the most Monday through Friday. Now these basics do not have to be boring and super classic if that's not your style. I love to stock up on elevated basics that have a thread of trend in them. For instance, I have this volume shoulder little white t-shirt, which feels very current and new, but I can wear it a zillion ways and integrate it with all of my clothes. Don't think twice about buying those basics. You will always wear them the most. You have way too many fancy statement or trendy pieces in your wardrobe. Case in point, this outfit, this is very much a statement outfit. And realistically, I'm not going to get a ton of wear out of this. So let's say I need to go somewhere, typically casual or whatever, everyday wear. I'm gonna look at my closet and I'm gonna pass right by this because it's not going to make sense for most of the occasions in my life. I also wanna show you guys something. 80% of this is statement, special occasion, and trend driven. Truthfully, most of the things I wear are in my drawers, but I do have a good balance, so I'll give myself that. The number three reason you have nothing to wear and in no particular order is that you do not have enough simple dresses and jumpsuits. Why this is so important is because putting on a dress or a jumpsuit looks like you styled and put together an entire outfit when you only put on one piece. So an example for me is I have a few black dresses that I just know and feel good in, that I know I can dress up with heels and maybe a handbag, or I can dress down with flats for my everyday life. And jumpsuits for me are just super functional. You always feel kind of like cool and styled, but they're so simple. And I'm telling you guys, anyone can look good in a jumpsuit. I have styled Gosh, I have styled senior citizens in jumpsuits. I have styled children and everything in between. You just have to try on a bunch of them to figure out which one looks best on you. Number four, you do not have any stylish and comfortable shoes. What do I mean by that? Well, it's seasonal, but for right now, summer basically, that is a great black slide that looks good if I wanna dress it up a little bit or if I wanna dress it down for every day. Also a clean white sneaker, again, looks great with dresses and looks good with jeans and leggings. And when we transition into fall, you are going to add a simple boot to that. These basics honestly anchor your wardrobe so you always have something to wear no matter what. The number five reason why you have nothing to wear is that you don't have any lightweight layers. How many times have you needed a little lightweight piece and you're like, I don't have any. For me, I love this little lightweight denim little jacket. I think it's from Madewell. I also love this little denim shirt that I wear as a shirt and I also wear it as a light layer. They give that little third piece trick that really pulls a look together and also they're for warmth. Now, obviously for all these tips I've shared, you need to tailor them to your own personal style, but I hope this gave you a clear understanding as to why you got a closet full of clothes and nothing to wear. Please let me know what you guys thought of this video. I hope it was immensely helpful. And uh, yeah, I think that's it for today. And thank you so much for watching. Mwah.